we're back. Part two of Chill Janaris Run. Where we left off right by here. About to swim over to Scalisti Island, which we're gonna do now. <clears throat> Three minutes to swim over. It's my guess. With this amount of stamina. If you remember, we spawned east of Electro, ran straight to Kami, went up to the castle, back down to Kami, up the road to where we are now seen evidence of players, I haven't seen any players, and it's a low pop server today, so I'm expecting a pretty chill run. Maybe just showcase where I would go after Skillisty, and how I would probably head for Starroy Millie via Sonichi and Delina. If you get an Electro spawn, a Kami spawn, well worth coming here. I'm hoping the loot will showcase why particularly because we're only an hour into this life we've already got a pioneer off a police car it should be low pop and I get sniped in the water Get over, dry our shit off, put our foot wraps on, and away we go. If we could find some 357 for the revolver, be beautiful. Maybe something better than the Pioneer. A Winnie, Mosin, Blaze with a scope. All depends on the ammo, what we fancy rocking. We ain't gonna find, I'm pretty sure we're not gonna find a scope for the Pioneer over here. So we're gonna have to rely on getting a better rifle. The Pioneer will do us while we're here. Not long now. Can't see anyone lining this up on the rocks, but you never know. minutes it's not far off pretty much bang on three minutes by the time we do another power swim once our stamina fills up again so even with no epi pen with about 75 percent stamina you're looking at three minutes there three minutes back and hopefully we'll see it be well worth it to take the time to scour this island there's not a lot to hit up shouldn't take you long Straight away, ring everything off, keep our temperature going the right way and prevent sickness. Can't do the working gloves. Take the shoes off. Foot wraps are dry because we left them in the... Oh great, they don't fit. Bring the coat out, then the jeans, then the hat, when we're ready to go. I 
arrow going back up on temperature now. Will do. So I don't think we got a mag for the M lock, have we? We have for the Pioneer though. The M lock's just chambered in here. Oh shit, we've only got one shot in the Pioneer as well, have we? Okay, that's shit. I thought we had a few more. Oh, it's got a mag in it. But only one in the chamber. Same same route every time on Scalisti. Castle first. scarf over the bandana. That bandage is dropped. That's pretty handy find though. A full one. I got a feeling someone's here. Whew, fucking Zed scared the life out of me. Deal with him before he aggroes. Fucking tank. Could be handy if someone is here. Oh, there we go. A mushroom, which would only spawn if someone has come through. So I reckon someone's here. Unbelievable. On a low pop server. This place. Someone come to do a bit of fishing. A bit of chilling like us. Oh no. Fucking Zed's gonna give me away now. Maybe we put the gun away so if someone's lining us up we don't get immediately banged. Take the chlorine. Sneaky now, we've seen that mushroom. This could be disappointing in terms of the loot that we find. We might have to engage if we see someone. But at the minute, we haven't got the ammo to do it confidently. One shot in the Pioneer, chambered M lock. It could be multiples, you know. Depends how far ahead they are of us, you know, in the looting cycle. Let's just eat this to get the food and water going up in the right direction, arrow-wise. A pair, so they did come this way. Spawned by another player's presence. See if I can see anyone doing any fishing, obviously. Obvious fishing, anyway. Mm -hmm. 
no bases on this server, so we know they're not camped over here le legitimately. Bit dangerous staying still like that, but wanted to just have a look, have a listen. The jacket is damaged. We've got nothing. Oh. Let's say we've got nothing to fix it up. We have. Again, has no ammo at the minute. But if we find 308 and we don't get a blaze, then it, it would be better than our M lock as a close range weapon because the M lock's only chambered. this climb to see what's up here. Hunting knife. I remember gonna sort all our loot. Probably if we survive and get back over to the mainland. We may have missed them. You know, they may have logged off over here, they may have swam back already. There's one building over here I want to check. It sometimes gets overlooked, this building, and it can spawn anything that you would find over here. Armor wise, gun wise. I remember we're going to ditch the dry bag when we get back over. It was only to keep our stuff dry. So if you approach it this way, someone was there looting. Maybe they were about to walk out the door. You get a nice shot on them then. Right. Hunter outfit because of the carrying capacity it gives you. Patch these up to warn. But the pumpies don't spawn over here, so that's been dropped. And it worries me, they've picked something up better. Blaze or something. To feel that they can drop that with a with a slug still in it. Make use of the jeans, pristine, so they can be used for foot wraps.
and then the natural progression is and the way they would probably go unless they camp in that building and they've heard us come in is this way to the coast work your way along the coast towards the lighthouse and then the buildings that are there the stuff does spawn on the lighthouse over here as well so well worth checking but i want to hug the coast because it gives you a brow of the hill a crest of the hill it gives you cover and also the person could think they're alone and then they've got all the time in the world to do some fishing down here At least we've got the shotty with two buck shots to clear the buildings, close quarters. And a pioneer shot if we can line one up with the iron sights for range. Carrying too much stuff though, but we haven't got enough ammo for anything to like start ditching stuff. Can't see anything obvious over by the lighthouse. Remember, we still need rope if we want to be able to fish. A flare. Ah, this has all been looted by some fuck. Savannah magazine. No one obvious. Camp it up here. Shoot me in the face now. Zombie scared me there in a minute. Nothing on the lighthouse. Let's just go and push and clear these houses over here. Hit the well. And then there's one more building on the way back over. So far we've picked up a pumpy we didn't expect to find. And a longhorn. And some hunting clothing of course. Don't need a heat pack, this is not the Molsk. <laughs> Don't need two hunting knives. Damn. 
Could have saved my fucking sewing kit. Another Hansen knife. Seven three nine and some food. Must have just missed that person then. Bear in mind, swap that out. <coughs> Excuse me. You don't need that. You don't need that. I just love Daisy. So it's now just put that dry bag in the wall with my shoes and rags and shit in it. Oh my god, it's fucking amazing. Got them disinfected rags. That's my gun cleaning kit gone. Excellent. I forgot the savannah takes 308. Fuck the M lock right off. So the game has fucked us there a bit with our dry bag. So we get sniped at the well now, just to chop it off. Drink a, bo drink a bottle, take a bottle. Eat the honey as we walk over. We actually haven't got a fish on the other side. We can just wring our clothes out and carry on our way. We got chlorine, so I didn't have to do this. But... Right, we got a longhorn. And we got ammo for it. We got a hunting knife. We got hunting clothing. Picked up a shotty that we hadn't found up to now, so someone had dumped the shotty for us, and we got two shots for that. So the shotty and the longhorn gives us, and the, okay, one shot in the pioneer, but 5.56 five, is quite easy to find. We can do bits. It's not amazing, but it's better than nothing. It's still only an hour and 10 in, or whatever it is, hour and 20 in. I'd say pumpy, longhorn, pioneer, all with ammo varying degrees of ammo not terrible start got this one log cabin over here which is sometimes overlooked as well hopefully overlooked
down through those trees. camp in the fucking radio tower. No fire coming out of the roof. We're still going to go in and clear it in preparation of someone maybe being there. There's a nice little view down to Kami. rounds I'll actually take the 22 in case we find an MK2 further on nice little zombie killer that can be so if I find a box of 357 I can dump the shotgun Make our way back to the point where we swam across. Maybe the person found that car and fixed it up. We found in part one. to swim back over, dry our shit out and then up the road, head in towards Sonichi. Get to that little block of houses first. On the way to Tulna, whatever it's called. The wraps are still only at one. completely dry out so that might not be a bad idea just shows good practice we've lost our matches we've still got our flare so maybe we'll keep it maybe we'll just ring our shit out so cheap mm. so so run I think we were really really unlucky to have been following someone and despite someone hoovering up all the best loot, we can assume, we still come out of it with a longhorn with ammo, pumpy with two shots, hunter jacket, hunter pants, hunter knife, chlorine tabs, you know, a bit of food. And it's taken... We'd be swimming there and back and searching the island, and we had to be a bit cautious because we didn't know if anyone was around 20 minutes. Fuck am I doing? Let's 
sure I saw movement on the beach, but it's probably just rendering him. Good if we could catch up with this clown though, and he's got himself a blaze or a mosin or tundra. We can take it off him. Losing health, but we'll, we won't lose a dramatic amount of health for this swim. Let's get off the other side. That arrow will start going back up again. I don't think we've we'll even lost the gap at the top. We'll check these houses out then, just in case there's something else handy in them. Eat up our honey, eat up our zagori. I tell you what we'll do, we will do a fire. We'll do a fire, fuck it. We'll cook our potato and chicken as well while we're here. We'll dry out all our shit. Clothes. Rags. We'll dry everything out. stick split into three short sticks double check yeah we got the flare <coughs> we split it here so it's not impeding us it's not in our hands in case we get into a gunfight just put the sticks there Fire worthwhile. Yeah. I get another two bits of chicken, another two but two hooks to put towards our bone collection. Or two bones rather. Piece of bark for the kindling, so we don't have to use a rag. Or open a box of ammo unnecessarily. That car's back there. Oh, remember we left it crashed up back against the... The thing. There's zero loot is a bit disconcerting. So someone's been using it. Sort of makes me think twice about the fire, but I also then think, fuck it. Got a shoddy, got a long horn to protect myself. One shot in the pioneer.
bother doing the individual bandages and stuff. Let's just try the clothes. That's the main thing. Oh, I shit my pants then. Thought someone was bursting through the door. Wow. <laughs> Out here. We know that car's been used, there's half a bandage in it. Hmm. Can't see anyone creeping on us, but there you go. Dipped. Some hydration from the chicken as well now. Try and stay off the main road. Just get it off our inventory now, off our carry space. Increase our stamina. Oh shit, we can drop. <laughs> Wash it all down. We had honey, potato, four bits of chicken, Sakori chocolate for dessert. Wash down the water. Good shape. Heat buff, all the clothes dry. 40 minutes into part two, we're on our way to Solnichi. We could, we could look to replace those with full bandages. Two might be two hours long because it's only a, a skillet ski took out quite a lot of it. <coughs> if you look at it, 
Most people jump on daisy, two, three, four hour stretches, maybe more. If that's going to take you half an hour to swim over, swim back, investigate Skalitsky and just to get some decent stuff, I think it's well worth it, especially if you spawn Kami or right on the outskirts of Electra like we did. Or even if you spawn up here in Sonichi. It's a bit of a run down as you can see here, but I think it's well worth it. You do get deer spawns here as well. If we wanted to do a bit of hunting, quite often there are deer spawns. Not, not today, I can't hear any anyway. See the feeder there. I just sheared one up there, I think. There is a little town up there. T Tulna, I want to say it's called. Coming up to the inter intersection soon, where it's... Where it's... it's Veers off to the left, if you want to go there. Yeah, and there's a beige house, a stilted, a moustache we can loot. Nice little jetty to fish off at the back. This hunting stand is what I was looking for. See if we can get lucky. Nope. Now there's the deer, you can hear there on the left if you wanted to go hunting. But we're not going to bother, we just had a nice bit of grub. Not desperate to get a fire going or anything yet. Again, I'm got anything to light it with for starters. We would need a drill kit. That's not no hassle. And we're getting closer to it actually. Bit of an interchange this little spot. People transitioning down from Sonichi, up from Kami, Scalisti like us. You know, there's a chance those Zeds could have spawned in on the other person who was in front of us. I'm not sure how you pronounce it. Tulna or whatever it, the actual pronunciation is there. Pretty sure it's Tulna. Another chicken. Zeds. Big blue dry bag there. If we were so inclined, I mean, we were already rocking a purple one. I would, I would have picked that up if it was in worn condition and it was black. So Nietzsche up there, where we're going next. IJ mag. Should we carry it just in case? I mean, if we found an IJ, we could ditch the the revolver begrudgingly. I mean, we're not being stealthy at the minute, running up and down this coast, so we might as well rock the boots for the insulation. We can always make new foot wraps when we get back to a town we want to be stealthy in. friend from Scalisti definitely came this way. Trap zombie.
Ooh. Even better. Black Raider hat. Whew. Did they go on to Solnichi or Tolna? Probably Solnichi. There's the medical centre there and the civilian barracks. We can spawn some decent shit. It's got a new hat out of that. I think it's worth taking this on the cheap high and wide. Because it can be a shit show. We can have a little peek in with the long horn. Let me own the place. Nothing coming in and out of the main road, first glance. The sawmill up coming up here now, big red building can be a camp fest. On the official servers, this can be an absolute nightmare if you find geared base, bases here. It's so difficult to get out of this spawn without hitting the well, hitting the medical. What You want to hit all that good stuff and then you find someone here with a base shooting you with a bison or something. Annoying. Industrial. First glance. We've got the quarry here. That's some absolutely nasty overwatch spots. So there's the civilian barracks. Sometimes you get people camping that hill there. Camping this roof is common. There's the civilian barracks. We're going to take a risk and climb this to have a little scout out of the the town. If someone was up here aiming a shotgun at our face, we'd be dead. Or up there camping. Or they could have just run over from Delina. Civilian barracks. Medicals over there, other side of the beige. Couple of zombies down there. A bit quieter than usual, I would say. jacket if that's your bag. Another one. Oh! Pioneer rounds. Huge. BDU jacket if that's your bag. Some smoke pistol shit.
gonna search this because you can get ammo in these. Not today, frying pan. <clears throat> I want to hit a medical, but I don't want to aggro, well, any Zeds, if I can help it. We've got the big boots on, so it's going to be difficult. Find the hunting shop, I forgot the hunting shop. Quiet as fuck, though, really don't like it. <coughs> Flying pack, what am I going to do with them? Apart from, yeah, plant them. Empty though. Apart from the seeds, doesn't look great. Let's deal with this fucker. Granny, no. Oh, at least. I think there's traps heads in there, isn't it? Granny with the tomato. Fuck it locks the medic on one side, traps the zombies in there. Oh shit. That Zed was uh, aggroed as well. Oh, fuck. Okay. Someone we know. We're still on the trail. Choose your fights then with the Zeds. This time that. Ooh, 
quite finished with Solmichi yet. These couple of buildings by here. Small medical stuff, and sometimes they're not as thoroughly looted as the medical center itself. Case in point full bandage to replace that one. An NBC, if you wanted it. We don't, but. Spawns medical stuff, see? <laughs> but I'm not greedy. The three full bandages are all we need. And we're happy then, anyway. Did ask a listy friend then just go to Delina like we would so on, the, on their way to Storoy Millie. <gasps> oh, yes, we got the jacket that we love. get a black bandana for the face or the camo one or a plain green one I mean, we could loot for food we still need rope remember but we're not desperate we can hunt we've got the pioneer we've got the longhorn See if we can stay on this guy's tail for a minute, just not to give him too much head start if he did come this way, heading, heading towards Starroy. Maybe they stop and fish on the way or something, you know, hunt, cook something up. We're good on water, we'll find food in this little town ahead now. There's tons of it. Zombies chill. I quite like these sheds. Okay, not today. I don't like them today. That fucking police car crash spawn? What? No, I've never seen one there before. Deal with Granny. Brilliant. That's a lovely little drop, that is. Six pristine rags and a can. Fucking is a police car crash. I haven't seen one by year, ever. I've seen one up further up the road towards Delina. A 
to take these guys out one by one because the chances are yeah over here son Five five six for your pioneer torch, right? Come on in. You can see me. I know you can see me. There, there, there we go. Fucking die, will you? Okay, not great, but we dealt with them without a cut. Oh. Prisoner one there. If we needed rags, I would take it. We'll take the beer. But the pioneer mag would have been nice. Oh, fuck it, we're not rocking anything 380 anyway. All that for a beer. Okay. No smoke coming out of the mustache. Not a bad place to cook up if you've had a bit of hunting or fishing though out of Salichi. Scabby old trackies. Onwards. Just over an hour in to the second bit. Off from Scalisti up towards this next little town in between Sonichi and Dolina. Which is pretty good if you want to scavenge for food. Can get some good ammo, get some good melee weapons really got room for a bat or anything at the minute though so probably happy enough with the cleaver we've got the hunting knife if you want to switch out just round the bend hit some more houses it is a spawn point up the top of the hill so freshies possible through Delina, the little summer camp after Delina, if we get there, you should, oh look at this, it's a joke, Three shots, so we only had two shots with the shotty anyway. A lot lighter to carry. Punch is just as hard. Told you to get food in these. Nearly always. Maybe because it's a spawn area. I can hear deer as well if you wanted to hunt. Yeah, we managed to drop one of our guns now, the pumpy. Shots in the revolver. Probably not as threatening with one gun on our back as well.
greedy. We'll just take the two boxes. That doesn't spawn you. That's been dropped you by, by a fresh here, I think. I'm going to search everything. I've been clipped by you before. Proper one shotted, head shotted, coming out of the log cabin down the bottom. So I'm always a bit weary of these trees, the sniping campers. Coming out of there, I was. Fuck off, chicken. Just get the shit out of me. Really? <laughs> and then see the turn in the road and then Delina. Well, there's a hunting shop and a PD we want to hit up. these trees because when I got sniped on this server by her before no sign of anyone coming this way though for sure yet no dead zombies trap zombies drop shit maybe that drop stone but that could have been a freshie no police car crash there can be one there in the background there. Just see if I can see anyone sloping between buildings. Any dead zeds and no zeds at the minute, which is a worry. And there's a zed, just chilling. If there's a freshie, I'd be looting all this, but I can't be bothered now. Don't need to. That extra bit of stamina is nice now that we've... It's just a runner down there. Chilling Zed's there. 
And there, okay. Just hip from the trees, that would be ironic. Not surprising either. Paying so much attention to the town, watch it, don't watch your back, boom. Door on the top of the PD's closed. Oh, I didn't want him to do that. trapped in there or has he just wandered in? Atlas bipod. Fuck. Trap to me. All locked. Packed or locked, front door closed. Oh, get over the fucking fence. 
What are you doing? Oh my god. Desperate to get tonight. Summer camp and then it's on to Staroy. Staroy. One tap now. I don't even need the 9 mil. I don't need that either. <coughs> Never find anything in these, but we'll go over there anyway. Instead of using the well and getting my head popped off. Right next to the PD there in Delina. We'll fill up in the stream here and then use the chlorine that we've got. Put it to use, might as well. that shit. No poopy water for us. <clears throat> Let's go in with our three revolver shots at the ready. I guess we finally catch up with this person. Another water bottle. Now that's uh, that's been dropped there as well. I'm actually, gonna keep that in case we want to make a bottle suppressor. So shit. Literally on this guy's ass all day. Onto Starroy Millie now. And this is where it can get hairy. Ton of Zeds. A chronically very good overwatch position. Opposite for snipers to camp. Then both sides are wooded. It's so easy to creep on people. We could go and have a look at the Overwatch to an extent with the Longhorn. There's the turning. The dirt track there. around here once, got raided the very next day I put it up, so that was the end of that. That's why I don't be the build bases anymore. Nice hint. Hug the right hand side, stay out of, stay off the main track. In case someone's running down they've come the opposite way. 
through Staroy and hit the mini tent and then they go in to Delina or working their way up that way. I'm gonna go back to Sonichi for whatever reason. Maybe it's the guy who's got the car by Scalisti Island and he's just doing a, a, a loop. Probably should have the Pioneer Man to run by here. I see someone ban. much if we whether we survive die or whatever up here be about an hour and a half for part two then and then it would be staroy to that novi starry in part three if we're alive can't see any mushrooms or anything here Could take it wide left and go to the Overwatch ourselves. We've got the Longhorn, so we can get a bit of a visual. There it is. There's the Millie. There's the right-hand side set of trees that people can camp. But it's the left-hand side I'm scared of. We stay below the crest of the hill. amount of effort to go to before hitting that milli but pioneer out while we clear the area actually revolver so I can go bang 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 with the revolver Can't see or any obvious heads. No, oh, there's one. Oh, there's another one by there. I 
All right, fuck it. Let's go and clear it out. Try and clear it out. Loot it out. And then get somewhere safe mm, to start part three from. The plan, anyway. No thanks. Follow Zed's here, so I'd be shocked if someone else was here. Unless they're super, super sneaky. trouble oh shit m16 on the just lying on the roof okay there the way they fell anyone in the vicinity knows we're here though oh what on earth okay Okay. What the fuck? Okay. It's not the worst out of SKS sites I've ever seen. It's not the best.
Need a gun cleaning kit for it though. Feels like someone's been here though, like why the fuck would they leave a worn M16 with a mag in it? Even if you had an M16 you'd take the mag, wouldn't you? shots but Fucking USG mags everywhere, why can there be big, big M16 mags? We're gonna take a big risk here as well. Check this deer stand. Just ask him to be sniped with all our loots on us, but there we go. Find a big ass dry bag and nothing else. Got a banged up SKS, an M16 with two 10 round mags. A revolver with three shots. Rather that than the fucking scabby sites that were on ya. Yeah? We've got a bit of time. We'll go and search the PD, the medical, the hunting shop. And then we'll log out on our way to Novistari direction. That's the plan. But I wonder if the trail went cold that we were on, because I don't think we would have found that many M16s lying around. Well, saying that, if they were that many, maybe they took one themselves. And then just left the other three. Craziness, so. But look, from when we spawned at Electro, hour and a half, uh, sorry, two and a half hours in, SKS, M16, Revolver. Yeah, there's some police zombies for there. I 
What do we want in the P in the PD though? We're not gonna find 357. It is. Fuck. I really hope the front door isn't locked. Oh dear. I'm joking. This could have gone better. Could have gone worse as well. Though. Okay, I think we log off from here then. <laughs> I've been sniped in this window before. Double barrel. Sniped from that. I'm pretty sure it was from that moustache. Or the church. All these pricks are going mad, so... We'll call that part two. Over an hour this time. What is it, hour and a half? By the time we logged in and messed about, and then... Let me log back in. We'll probably check the medical. Maybe check the PD. Maybe hit the well. Got the Hudson shop by there as well. There. And then we're going out that way to Novi Stari. Anyway, that's the plan. It's a little overview to see. You can see how we're geared two and a half hours into our save from Electro Spawn. Food, the only obvious thing at the minute. Some bandages. Stabby M16 SKS and a revolver with three shots. Plenty of shots for the SKS. Only 16 M16 shots, so which is a shame. Oh, hang on. The. I knew I kept that for a reason. There we go. Two full ten mags now. Happy days. Part three will come up soon. <laughs>